Patrick Reed here, Instructional Technologist at Elgin High School in Elgin, Texas. This is my Google Certified Trainer video and I hope you learned something from it. Today we're going to look about organizing our drive and how it can be very useful and effective. Because it is so powerful and so strong, it does take a lot to organize sometimes, but it's very simple the way that Google has set it up. A one-to-one -one campus of iPads with over 1,300 iPads. I am helpful in, in, in increasing interactivity and engagement within the students by training teachers, assisting administration, and training students as well on how to use their devices appropriately and how to use them to increase their learning and to show their learning to the highest degree. Things I love the most about Google Apps and the way Google does for education is its ability to be very open-ended. And open-ended learning and open-ended discussion is the best way for students to show their learning and for teachers to collaborate and for them to get the most out of their education. Here's my Google Drive folder. As you notice, I'm in the list view, but it's also able to do over if you click right here on the grid view, able to go to grid. The grid view is also very useful. So you've got several images, like I do here. Now, if you go back to the list view, notice I do have some colors on my folders to draw my eye into them. So let's say that I want to use this EHS file a lot. I'm going to change the color to a bright red until much easier I'm going to be able to see and find those folders. Same thing on my images folder. I'm going to change this color to a bright blue. Also another way you can organize your drive is by adding numbers in front of your folders. So right now it's organized by last modified. I've organized by name. My EHS folders are no longer on the bottom, and also I want to be able to find my iPads folder really quickly. I use that a lot, so I'm going to right click, click rename, rename it 01 iPads, and then I use the EHS folder pretty frequently. So I'm going to name it 02 EHS files. This then puts my folders into an alphabetical order of most useful. Also notice that my EHS files is starred. Starring just like in Gmail, it's as simple as right clicking and adding a star. So that way it's another way I could find these. Now I have folders and files that are starred. So if I type in is colon starred on the search bar, just like in Gmail, I will find all of my files and folders that are starred. 